Hey guys, what's up? We're back here with the latest episode of the Godric Manson Mind Player season. This is episode number 35, and we're just here in London heading down to the house that we've been looking into buying recently. And we're just gonna have a meeting with the owner and just sort out a few things, a few bits and bobs in preparation for buying the house because it looks like it might just be happening. We'll have to stay tuned to see what happens after the next game though in this episode. And we'll just have to wait and see. Here's the owner here. We'll just have a quick chat to her, find out some details. We're gonna have to. She's arranged a meeting for us at in the in the middle of London in the city with the letting agent that she is with, the real estate agent. And we're gonna get in contact with them at the meeting and hopefully, hopefully, if all goes well, sign a contract. Then, but for now, we're going to head off and get on the away bus, the Chelsea away bus, on the way to our next game which is away to West Ham which is only across London so it's not too far so we don't have to leave too early or anything but here we are just arriving at the bus now at the Chelsea Stadium and there is the Chelsea away bus it is a nice one a definite upgrade from the Newcastle bus that is for sure look some of the players from this season and the Chelsea symbols and whatnot looks pretty damn cool if you don't mind me saying myself and here we're going to just drive off now onto the motor uh, on through town onto the motorway around <clears throat> and then get into West Ham about an hour or so later and we're going to get prepared for the game and head straight into this game so we haven't actually scored in the league yet this season we have an assist I believe maybe two and we're currently playing in the Champions League that's what we're really focusing on more than anything and we're playing for England in some international uh, Euro qualifiers. Here we are now. Chelsea sat 13th in the table. Only one win, two draws and one loss. And West Ham are sat in 15th, I believe. A couple of places just behind us. So it's quite an even game from the statistics. But hopefully we can push on. We've got the better squad, I reckon, player-wise. And let's just push on and hope for a win. Here we are at London Stadium with West Ham playing against them now. Here come West Ham on the ball with an attack with Ayu. Can he do anything with it here? Trying to get it into the box, but he can't quite make it in. Marcus Rashford, the new signing from last season, getting a shot away there. Courtois getting a save in. Good save from Courtois. Here comes Chelsea on the attack now. Manston getting on the ball up the right wing. Gets taken out there by the defender from West Ham. And it looks like he's going to get a booking here. He is. Manston drawing the foul there. 16 minutes played. Not a bad start so far. Not many chances created at the moment. But here comes West Ham on the attack now. Ayu again on the ball. Trying to get down that wing. Trying to cut central now. Lays it off. Who goes to Payet? Who has a shot there? And it goes in. Dimitri Payet goes and scores. Makes it 1-0 here in the 23rd minute for West Ham against Chelsea. And that is the opening goal of this game. Not many chances so far. And we've gone and conceded the first shot, really, that we've had against us. Except for the Rashford one. And Payet's gone and put his first goal of the season in the back of the net against Chelsea here today. Unlucky for us. Good goal from Payet. And let's just hope we can build on this. We've got plenty of time to come back with a win, hopefully, or even a draw. As long as we can get something out of this game. We've just been lacking in points lately. We've got two draws, a loss, and a win. And it's only the start of the season, but it is not the kind of start we'd want from Chelsea. Here's a great through ball there to the player having a shot or crossing it into Hazard, but he can't quite, or Pedro, and he can't quite get on it there. Here we are making another attack forward. I think that's Van Ginkel on the ball, number 35. He's been doing well lately. Can we get a ball into the box here? He doesn't quite make it in. Approaching halftime any second now. Chelsea getting on the ball once again, though, from that chest down. Laying it off to the central midfielders who are going to try and pass it around to feet. And there goes the halftime whistle here at the London Stadium. It is West Ham 1, Chelsea 0 so far in this game. Not many chances created for Chelsea. Not playing too well going forward. But we haven't been too bad at the back either. Lish letting in the one goal, which is through Dimitri Payet. But we can still build on this. Hopefully we can get something out of this game. We'll have to wait and see. Here we go now on an attack. Matson trying to take on the defender and losing it straight away. Matson getting back on the ball now a couple minutes later. Doing a bit of a roulette. Just enough space to make in runs into it there. Trying to run past Cresswell. And he, oh, cross in there, passed off Bonner, but it goes out for a corner kick. Here come West Ham on the attack now, Pyatt on the ball, trying to cut central. Can he do anything with it now? Pushing more. He's had a shot there, hit Rashford and gone out of play for a goal kick. Here comes the right back on the attack for Chelsea to Manston, who's going to lay it central. Can we put it into Mikel? Mikel's on the ball now. Can Mikel get it back to Manston? He can. We're having a shot here. Oh, it's just been missed. Hazard with the shot and it's gone in. Eden Hazard's gone and made it 1-1 here. 61st minute of the game. Chelsea have drawn level. Good shot there from Manson. Great layoff from Mikel. Hit the post. Comes back out. And Hazard goes and gets the rebound in there. And it makes it 1-1. 
Good goal from Hazard to keep his composure and chick it in the back of the net. Unlucky for Manson with that first time left-footed effort there hitting the post. But it's all good. We have gone and drawn level here. Now we can go on and try and get another goal. That's his first goal in the Premier League, which is surprising. He hasn't had the greatest of starts to the season whatsoever compared to usual. But he has scored in the Champions League, I believe, this season. So let's just hope he can go on and get some more. Same with us. Mikel's just been subbed off after that little run there. And Kante's come on for him. 63 minutes played now. Here come West Ham on the attack. Great through ball there to Payet. Payet to make it 2-1. And he's just... Been a great save there from Courtois to keep them out. Manson making a run down the right wing now. 72nd minute of the game. Can we get in the box here? Manson pushing forward, cutting in from the right wing area. Passing it to Costa. Costa holding onto it nicely, but we can't quite do anything with it now. He's holding onto it still. He's drawn a foul in there, but the foul's just been let go at the last second. Here goes Manson again. 79 minutes played now. Running down the right wing, trying to pass Cresswell. Cresswell's keeping up nicely, but Manson's going to make his way into the box anyway. Crosses it in. And he doesn't quite make it to the feet of the striker. And it's been cleared out of play there to the keeper's hands who punches it away and Manson can't quite get on it from the clearances from the West Ham players 81 minutes played 83 minutes played now sorry here comes here we come on an attack now Manson getting the ball through ball to Costa Costa back to Manson this is a great chance to make a 2-1 here and he's just gone and stuck it to the right side of the goal the netting with that finesse shot there that was so unlucky from Manson look how close that shot was there inches wide from making it 2-1 and probably snatching a late victory here for Chelsea unlucky for Manson that's just not gone our way 87 minutes played now here we come on an attack again Costa on the ball trying to get it by central Manston on the ball too oh unlucky with that shot I was trying to remember who that guy's name was and I can't quite remember off my head but he's gone and missed there here is four minutes of added time coming in now Manston laying it off to Kante who's had a good effort but he can't quite do anything with it there and here we come now, West Ham on the final attack of the game by the looks of it. Can Marcus, Marcus Rashford make it 2-1 here? Another chance there for West Ham and he can't quite capitalise on that. Here they come again, Pyatt on the other wing, crossing it into the box there. Straight to Courtois' hand. And there goes the final whistle here today at the London Stadium against West Ham. It's finished 1-1 here. Both teams come away with a point. And that game's over now. And as you remember from the start of this episode, we were talking about having a meeting with our real estate agent the ones in charge of letting the house from the um, current owner and we're gonna head off to their real estate office now here we are just arriving a couple days later after that game we've just been paid as well so we got a bit more money to add in and we're just gonna hope that we can push on and get this contract signed today if possible and here we come now into the main office the contracts waiting on the table here it is, this is the moment we've been waiting for. The house contract for 1.5 million to buy that house we've been looking at. Signed, sealed and delivered. Here we are, sold. We're now down to about 800,000, but that's okay, we can make it that back. We've just bought this house, 3655 this is our house number in the middle of London. And here we are now, just coming into the next game. Chelsea versus Sunderland at home. And we're gonna kick off very shortly. So glad we bought that house finally. You guys have been looking for me to buy that house. And now the next thing on the list is to buy a car. Now I have a really good car in mind. It's an expensive one. So you guys might have to wait a few episodes for us to make some money back off our wages before we can go and buy that. But we'll keep you entertained anyway. We've got plenty of international fixtures coming up. Plenty of Champions League football as well as some league football like today here against Sunderland. And here we are kicking off Chelsea versus Sunderland at Stamford Bridge. And we've just kicked off here. Can we get a result today? We've been struggling for them lately. First minute of the game, just passing it around nicely. Manston getting on the ball here, six minutes in now. Manston trying to push around the defenders here from Sunderland, getting a ball to feet and crossing it in the box there. Nothing quite comes of it, but here comes down. Keeper just punches it away at the last second. Manston getting on the rebound, but it gets pulled up for a foul from Costa, fouling the goalkeeper there. Here we come now, Manston getting on the ball, the right wing overlapping, the underlapping one from Ginkle. Ginkle back to Manston and Van Ginkle can't quite get that to his feet properly. Unlucky though, here we come once again on an attack now, Manston getting on the ball. Can we take a decent shot here? Look at this shot, so close to going in and it doesn't quite make it. What an effort that would have been from Manson. Good try, good effort, about 30 yards out there. That would have been a screamer, possibly goal of the season. It's just gone and hit the post from that distance. But here we are, continuing on this game. Manson with the ball, having a chance. And not getting past that as the last Sunderland man there. 28 minutes gone here. And here we come with another attack down the right wing. Doing a roulette, trying to push around the defender. Costa takes it, three balls it back to Manson. Great little layoff here. Can we do anything here? Little roulette, can we work it in? We've just taken 
one touch too many and push it too far after that failed roulette attempt. We are trying to do more skills. I know you guys like skill goals, and I'm trying to work on it and just make sure I can get it incorporated into my game. There's a good shot there from the Sunderland man who was offside after that little shot. Here comes Manston on the ball, approaching half-time now. Can we get anything? We've just lost it there. There goes a the half-time whistle. It is 0-0 here at half-time at Stamford Bridge. Very, very good chance for Manston to make it 1-0 for Chelsea with that long-range effort. Doesn't quite make it in. It looked like it was going in, but it didn't quite get there. But here we are now, pushing on the right wing. 56 minutes play, getting tackled and losing the ball to Sunderland, who are going for a little attack of their own now. 63 minutes played. Here they come. Barini on the ball. Fouled there by the Chelsea man. And it looks like the Chelsea player, Baba, is going to be booked. Yes, he is. He gets a yellow card for that foul. And here we come now on the attack. Chelsea pushing up the left wing with Manston, who's cut across the other side of the pitch just to get into some space that was open. Manston pushing central. Can we get the ball in the box now? Just touching it around the defenders. Good chance to have a shot here. We've taken one touch too many round. Trying to dodge that side tackle, and we've gone and lost it and ran into the other player. Here we come now. Baba on the left wing, crossing it into the box there to nobody in particular in the middle. And Sunderland going clear. 82nd minute now. Can we work this into the box? Last eight minutes of the game. Can we get a chance here? Good cross in the box. Just being cleared out by the defence. And here we come once again. Manson on the right wing. 89th minute play. Now not much is happening in this game for chances. It looks like it's going to be a nil-nil draw once again. And another point on the table, which is not what we want. Just losing it there. Out for a throw. And here comes Manston getting on the ball from the right wing. Trying to take it around the Sunderland back four. But we can't make it anywhere near these defenders today. And there goes the final whistle. Pretty, pretty bad game to be honest from my point of view. From the whole team's point of view really. And we've gone and got another draw. This is not the way we panned out our Premier League season so far. And we've just got, we've got I think four draws, one win, one loss so far this season. So we haven't lost many, but we keep drawing and dropping points when we should really be winning them. Just back home now in our new house. And we're just contemplating how we've been doing lately. And we've had some bad press lately as well, says the manager saying, I'm not performing to expectations, which is really, really putting me off, putting me down a bit. But it's just going to kick, I'm just going to kick on and kick up. And hopefully we can get some results in the coming games. We have a big game coming up, as you can see here. We have Copenhagen in the Champions League in the next game, which is the next episode. So, guys, please stay tuned for the next episode. It's going to be a big game. We're going to hopefully get all three points in that league, uh, in that Champions League game. But for now, we're going to head off to bed and go to sleep and just forget about that last game. Forget about the last couple of results as well because they haven't been too great for us. We bought our house, though, which is a positive, and we're going to go to sleep in it now and have a good night's sleep in preparation for the next couple of games we've got coming up they're pretty big games so i'll see you guys in the next episode please like share and subscribe for more videos because they are on their way hopefully every day i'll see you in the next episode see ya